Hey Facebook, this is Kate Houston with Channel 8. Uh, right now I am inside of the Westland Fair Plaza, which is near Charleston and Decatur. Uh, this is where a shooting happened uh, late last night, early this morning. It happened around 3 a.m. at PT's place. Um, I'm gonna turn the camera around and show you guys the situation here. So uh, we're told there's quite a few cop cars last night. Of course, right now the scene has really cleared out, uh, but this is where that shooting happened and involved uh, two men. Metro police say that they were there separately for several hours. Um, at one point, one man went up to the other, shot him, and then left. Uh, we're being told the victim is a Hispanic male in his 20s. Uh, as of this time, they're still looking for the suspect in this shooting. Uh, so if you have any information, if you know of anything, uh, police are asking that you call Crime Stoppers. Uh, to give some of that information and help in this investigation. As you can see, this is a pretty, you know, common plaza that we see around Las Vegas. A lot of, uh, you know, different businesses. We have some corporate ones. We have some local ones. Um, and I, I spoke to a few of them. Uh, they didn't want to be on camera, but some of them say that, you know, this is just a, a normal place. It's normally very safe. They haven't had any issues here at PT's place. It's usually just a pretty quiet neighborhood bar. Uh, I spoke to some locals as well who were in the area and they, you know, said the same thing. Really, they've never had an issue here. They love frequenting the shopping area. So this comes as a, a bit of a shock to them that this would happen, especially given the fact that, uh, you know, police say these two men uh, were there separately and were not there together. So coming up tonight on 8 News Now at 5, 6, and 6.30, we are going to have live coverage of this um, and hopefully provide some, some more details of what happened. Um, we have some uh, requests out to get some surveillance footage to hopefully you know, potentially have the suspect in this case on camera, um, but we will have all of those details coming up tonight, so make sure to join us. Uh, you can also watch, of course, as we stream on our website, that is 8newsnow.com. Thanks so much, guys. We'll see you tonight.